Welcome to Technical Drawing. Today we are going to solve this sum in auxiliary. See, this is front view, top view, and we have to draw auxiliary top view over here. So first we will draw the given two views, and we'll draw auxiliary line at 45 degree, and we'll divide circle into eight parts. So we are dividing cone into eight parts. Why we are doing this? Because we don't have many points when you want to transfer. See this, all these points we don't have. So we can divide into eight parts or twelve parts. So if I'm dividing into eight parts, then I will draw front view and top view like this. I will take this points up and mark generator. This is A B C D E F G H. O M is the axis. This is A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash, E dash, F dash, G dash, H dash. O dash and M dash. Now after this, we have to draw auxiliary. The auxiliary will be at what angle? Forty-five degree, because we are doing first angle. So draw forty-five degree from E dash, D dash, F dash. So from all these points, you draw forty-five degree. After that, you draw 45 degree from O dash also. You can write all this A B C D E F G H and O. See this, all these points you will write and O. Now take X Y to A. This distance you take, and from X one Y one you cut it down like this. So that's why we do naming, so it helps. X Y two B dash. X Y two B. And X one Y one two B. See this. So whatever distance we have in top view, that we are transferring. So now instead of X Y, now we have new X one Y one. See this. This distance. From here, you cut it over here. Same way, you keep on doing it for all the eight points. From D also, you extend like this. See this. From E also, this way. And then X Y to O. See this. So you got all the points. Now what you need to do? You need to join all these points. Now in this case, it will be freehand. Now, if you divide this into twelve parts, you will get more points. So it will be easier to draw. You know, freehand. Now, see, observer is watching it from here. So which part will be nearer to him? This front part, G, H, A, B, and C will be nearer to him. Right? Now remember one thing: in cone, always draw. Slightly more than the half, so then it will be easier for you to draw this tangent. See this, this tangent line won't be joined directly to point G or C. It will be tangent to that curve, and then remaining curve will be dotted. Why? Because it is away from the observer. Point E is away from observer. See this, when observer will see from here, this is away from observer. That's why it is dotted. Then you can mark this axis point M. So O to M would be axis. So this is auxiliary top view. I hope you people have understood. Thank you.